Antoinette, Jess, it is hot standing here for just a few minutes in the sun, let alone trying to take on this course. And Sunday, as Kellyanne was just saying, is going to be even hotter. So this race is postponed until next month. The heat wave just kept building and building and building, and it wasn't clearing at all. It'll be a Banner Beach Day on Sunday at Carson Beach in South Boston, what will be day six of this heat wave and a chance to cool off in Dorchester Bay. But it wouldn't be a great one to be on roads around the beach, running and biking two legs of the Columbia Threadneedle Investments Boston Triathlon in high 90s temps plus humidity, not to mention thousands of spectators along the route. And so the 14th annual race is postponed until next month due to the heat. EMS said, you know, this is just not a safe event for anybody. If you're dedicating emergency resources to this race, and the air conditioning goes home in an elderly home somewhere in the city, and you don't have the resources to support those people. That's not right as well. Race director Mike O'Neill said they work with several city and state agencies to coordinate a year in advance, but somehow they were able to move the kids race to Saturday, August 20th, and the triathlon with thousands of participants to Sunday, August 21st. I think the athlete safety um, is important, but also the volunteer safety and all the people that that come together to, to make the event happen. But I always say that um, it's harder to support a triathlon than the race triathlon from a hydration standpoint, because you're out in the sun, you're forgetting to hydrate, you're you're just caught up in the excitement of it all, and by the end of the day, you're just absolutely wiped out. That's, an, that's under normal summer conditions, not what we're experiencing in Boston right now. So look on the bright side, and there's definitely a bright side on a day like this. No question about that. No pun intended. There is more time to train as a participant. Of course, you got to be bummed out a little bit, but there's also time to help. Boston Medical Center is a program we've been devoting our resources to. There's more information on our website, WCVB.com. We're live on Carson Beach. Josh Brogadier, WCVB News Center 5.